Welcome back to control. Let's find some more plants. Ooh, okay. Now I think that's what it was that over there. Somewhere. I wish my leaves were as pretty as yours. You're doing fine. Does someone can do smoke pop. Maybe there was some plant in here. Oh, I don't know. Glabs? Have we been here? Oh, it's the music lab. Yeah, so we've been here. Uh, wait. Who repaired everything? The oldest house. The biggest mistress. What the hell? <laughs> repaired the lab. They so thoroughly destroyed. Okay, so I'm fairly sure this is all on the lower level of the plants. Yeah, that one's going. Please do not spawn enemies while I'm here. I really appreciate that. I'm just looking for some plants to get to. Do you have a family? I have a brother. I miss him a lot. Wait, don't you do much of food now? Okay. Hmm. Maybe in this shelter? I don't remember which one. Yeah, this one wasn't discovered, and this one has a shelter as well. A possibly a, a possible AWE in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via a phone line. Even is notably similar to AWE blank, in which blank blank. Event is believed to have been caused by blank blank and as a result of following measures have been taken to prevent blank 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 blank. I hope you really like <laughs> how those reports are filed in. I appreciate some but most of them are blank out uh, as makes them look more SCP like more like really they say program. I'm the director, but what does that mean? That you're the... I have no experience in leadership roles. I have no on-the-job training. Hmm. Been here? Oh yeah, we've been HR lab. Yes, it's probably over here. Nine. Maybe it's right next to the control point. Oh, so inside here. Wait, where are we? Right back? Oh. Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants in research. Is it really necessary to sink them? I mean, the janitor does have a nice voice and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe he could just switch it up a bit? I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember, rem remember when they were planted, and people like them a bit too much, if you ask me. Are we being invaded by houseplants? Worth looking into it. Oh, I would love to be invaded by houseplants. You know, they make... Uh, oh, they make oxygen use. Synchronicity is a phenomenon long recognized by the wise but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize in events connected by no identifiable causality. It clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master? It was occurred miles away. The world is un. un Unified in ways we do not yet understand. 
And sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen chords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledging research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce blank behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. This tree may not remember our names, but God himself will. No, just a woman in a bed. No wonder they were invaded by his. Oh, Dante, where are you? I swear. Good. Oh. Okay. No. Oh, the... no, run, 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 run. I fell and it cost me. He just disappeared? Not that I mind, but it was a bit strange. Oh, but I hope it's not the last one. We can get over with it. Oh god, damn it. it's not again. It was sad. Of course it was sad. It was completely. Flora felt really brings out the green in your leaves. It does, right? <laughs> That's all of them. Ooh. But I kind of wish there were more. They're good <laughs> listeners. You know, right? Okay, where? What? No, it's there. It's actually one level below. <laughs> or not. I'm just lost again. I don't care. We need to go back. Where is it? Where exactly? We need to go. Uh, clear the clock. But where do we. Oh. How do I check it? Where's the map? There's no. There's no map. Okay. So we are going to the executive sector because it is fastest. 
way to the control point and I got lost again. Um, maybe Pope wants to talk about No, his followed you in, right? No. Okay. Is this is Luke here? Salvador, head of Bureau of Security. I'm making a formal security order due to the incident in April. Case number 21HQ593. Improper use of the jukebox altered item led to two fatalities. We believe a pair of agents used the jukebox to travel to the quarry threshold and engage in inappropriate workplace behavior. An expedition team found them decomposing at the formation's base a week later. At least we found out the jukebox doesn't bring corpses back when the song ends. I'm having the jukebox placed okay, in a secure location in the we'll executive sector. To that. It should we'll never have been accessible. Sure. Yeah, for sure. I remember him talking about the jukebox. Mm, and now you're completely ignoring me and I don't mind. Let's spend something. No, of course not enough. Enough. Hmm. Round grenades and rockets. Yep, give me that. And let's travel to maintenance and exactly. Wait, okay, so this opens up something, but I don't know where it is. It... Yeah. We'll go near the furnace again. Where can be the hmm. Maybe it is near the, uh, the pipe work. It's I don't think it's through the pipe works. Hmm. Well maybe it is not through maybe you should, we should go from the upper level of the maintenance. And I don't know. I have no idea how to get there. Hmm. I hope we'll find out. Maybe... It's the furnace. This is the way. I really should go back to the NSC power plant and try getting them to do upper maintenance. Maybe we should have used the elevator in the first place. We can't get up there. Maybe it's through there. But how the hell we get over there? Okay. Oh, I think, I think this is correct that we should get over there somehow. We can't really fly. That's a problem. Make it from something like yeah. Okay, we can fly. <laughs> uh, and we are at the upper level of this place. Okay. Okay. Just do not screw that up. Please jump up there. Mm -hmm. Get in higher, not really. Is this the plug? It looks like the plug. It would clog up the whole place. I'll get up there. Mm. And I don't. We can't really make it up anywhere. Mm. I don't really get up there. Unless. Okay, that works. I have no idea if that was the way It's not okay, so I don't really want to go over there just yet. I want to explore first. And I'm fairly sure this is the way we are supposed to get. I don't know. Yet. Oh, come on! Hmm. So, all this effort, nothing. 
at least I know this is the door we were looking for. No. Yeah, so basically all this for nothing. At least, well, at least we know how to get up here. and that recovery. Give me that. Yeah, something else that seems to be useful. That better version of it. That's better version of that. Please shout at me if I destroy something I'm not supposed to. Just checking the what the hell the audio in my in my headphones cut off. I have no idea what's going on. I may have to restart the game, but I can make it through this part. What the hell that's so interesting just suddenly cut off. I can see audio levels in my software, but I don't hear anything. And if this means that my headphones are broken, I'm gonna cry. I'm honestly gonna cry. Let's travel to the... What was it? Communications department. Uh, it's from the dead letters. It's closest. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Give me a second here. I will... Yeah. I will save. I will, st I will restart the game. And if that doesn't work, I will run the diagnostics. Whatever happened to my headphones all of a sudden. Be right back. Okay. It was stupid. But I just muted my headphones on the keyboard and didn't even notice. <laughs> it's not my fault. I've never had... I've never had a keyboard that can... ...good mute headphones. Communications. Where the communication? I think it's upstairs. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> It's not upstairs. <laughs> Sorry. No matics, no. Mailroom, no. Delta, no. Where is it? It's supposed to be upstairs. But I really miss the door. It should be right on the the doors closed shut and I can't go over there and go in the cafeteria. Ah, oh, god damn it! Where exactly? There's somewhere there. Over uh, here. This is close shut as well. This is closed. You here? No, no, I can't get free. I, wait, it, it was cool. There's a bathroom. Am I going crazy? Or some of those doors weren't closed before? Oh, is 
this place? No, I'm not going inside. What? She saw some there, something up there. That's not the case. Hmm. Uh, we can go through. We can't. We definitely can go through here. Where's the central executive? This is definitely not the right place. But we could go through the director's office. Oh, basically for here. <laughs> References to the thing up here. <laughs> the map makes it look connected, and I'm so confused. But the, uh, the in theory, I should be able to go through here and through here, and then through here. This is the way we came in. We used to come in. And then... Back to my room. Of course they're gonna appear. Yes, I just like them. Ooh, sorry about that. Hello? Oh, that's a little bit. Mind if I do this? Hey, Malcolm. Yes. Tea time is at 7. I'll see you at the course on Sunday morning. By the way, have you heard about this Tennyson report? Apparently, there's a bunch of copies to drifting around the office. French is looking to get his hands on any information about who wrote it. You wouldn't happen to have heard anything about that, would ya? See you Sunday! Oh really? Oh, maybe I should like this. Oh, I somehow ignored the fact that you don't need to do any in order to shoot. I think it was in the middle. It has something like that implemented. Wait, somewhere there. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is why I don't play too many shooters. The best I've heard it doesn't really come from. I think he's somewhere up there. He's just hiding. Okay, never mind, we have 13 minutes. It's true. We're here. Yes, we made it! No. Locations. What the hell is this place? Really? Oh, I think I have one of those. I like those with armor. They are so easy to kill. And they're easier to kill than those guys. Oh, oh, oh hello, hello, hello. And 
that seems to be all. Okay, this is actually the first time we've been here. Wait, we're not here. Last month, our on-site server experienced an intrusion by unauthorized users. After a thorough investigation, it was confir confirmed, confirmed that the users only accessed a video file which contained portions of various Dr. Darling presentations. Investigator investigators were able to track the users through their IP addresses. The following are the confirmed identities of these users. Patrick Studient, Rubens Nogueira, Arto Kulameki, Christopher Mills Bowling, Jack Hosarin. These individuals are in breach of Bureau Code 91 and have been placed under surveillance by our external investigation team. Further action is pending. Now I, I couldn't hit escape again. flashing red? Look at... I am in the communication department, aren't I? Really, can I open this? I am in the communication department, so why do you mean? Why go to the communication department? You cannot be... It's not. I know what I'm looking for, but it's um, non existent in here. It should be somewhere there, but it's not. It doesn't exist. And there's nothing I can do about that. No, I can try to destroy this whole place. Be somewhere. I don't see it. It is hiding. No, oh, it's not hiding. No. There's nothing there. It tried. I really tried. It just. Not there. Which is sad. This is our first painful bug in the game. And it's sad. Pay attention, Alberto. This is the last time I'm explaining this. Internal lockdowns are manually triggered events that lock one of or all of the sectors by restricting use of the sector elevator, effectively locking staff in their sector until the emergency is handled. They can only be lifted via the directional override in maintenance order the director is satisfied once the director is satisfied that the situation is under control. External lockdowns are a big deal. Nothing in or out of the whole building. It's only triggered by a code red conta containment bridge, based on some complicated system that security and research slapped together. It can only be lifted once. A. A threat that has... The threat has been neutralized, or B. And B. A high clearance individual gives the system the all clear. The process is not the same as the directional override, and so stop us saying so in documentation. I know it's confusing as hell, I've told Darling a hundred times to change it, but there, at the moment, it stays the way it is. Honestly, I don't think they know how to change it at this point. Let's just make sure our staff understand and how this mess all works, okay? Eh, they probably no one understood it. In the end. I really need her to work on this. Does it work? Is it there? Because I know where it should be. <laughs> Maybe I need to put a grenade on it. Is it just invisible? So I know I'm not really ripping the place apart, but it looks cool. Can I really? Oh. 
Can I use the fire extinguisher to make the invisible ones visible? That's a thought. This is closed, yeah. We got here by the stairs, so... No, need to visit. You're listening to America Overnight, mystifying the airwaves for more than 40 years. Okay, again. Because I cut it in the middle. You're listening to America Overnight, mystifying the airwaves for more than 29 years. Thank you for staying up with us. Ghosts. We've had many callers over the years tell us of hauntings, voices, and other phantasmagorical phenomena. Today, friend of the show, Dr. Quincy Reagan, tells his story. Quincy, thanks. This is something I experienced recently while staying at the Chili Pines Motel in Macon for last year's Suspicious Con. I was in room 47. The night manager, an avid listener of the program, insisted I take this particular room now, the manager explained that years back, the body of a man was discovered under the bed, inside that wooden border that motel beds tend to have. And the body had been there a week, he said. Guests had stayed there, sleeping with the corpse a foot below him. They only found the body when housekeepers complained about the smell. Hauntings have been reported in room 47 ever since. I happily took the room. I fell asleep pretty quick, checking under the bed first, of course. No ghosts visited me, no chilly spots or flickering lights. But when I woke up, I found myself under the bed. It was dark and stiflingly hot. Luckily, I was able to push the mattress off and crawl out before I suffocated. The night manager was kind enough to find me another room. Oh, there you have it, listeners. What we call ghosts take many forms. Quincy was brave enough to tell his story, and I encourage you to keep calling and writing whenever you encounter something strange, something you can't explain. Maybe you're seeing colors that we have no name for. Maybe your toaster is possessed. Remember, dear listeners, when no one else believes you, we do. A bag overnight, we'll be right back. My poster is definitely possessed. He plays video games. I actually think this is a good place. Take okay, up like, what the hell is wrong this place? Ben Fruz. Okay. Uh, for an hour, half an hour. Uh, this place. This is chill. But for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!